this is going to be a little uh, video on drills, sword, sword movement drills for Bolognese. And like all the other videos, this is all being done in uh, one take. So uh, this is what you get. I hope it's good. This is going to focus on movement of the sword around the cone of defense, which is very common. This is just basically going from finestra to finestra. Now, you can do this in a very calm manner, but then you can start to accelerate it. And you start to get cuts. From the reversal side, you get a uh, you get a fendente. From the mandrito side, you get a mezzato. So that's just the first part. It's just this violent change of guard. Now notice it's a lot of wrist action. Now you can start turning this into a proper or normal or recognizable short compass cut, and then you can start alternating between the two, so that you have. Cut double cuts on every on, you, on both sides. So I'm cutting side to side, then I can double the cut up, cutting side to side, and I double the cut up. Okay. Um, another drill related to this that involves wrist actions is this this uh, ridoppio or true edge sotani fendente combination, which can both be done up and down and side to side, and do not doubt that I'm moving my body. I'm just not making a large, uh, putting a lot of emphasis on body motion. This will also now become compressed to become this motion here, which is changing from frontale to finestra, or from faccia to testa. And this is important because this is an inversion of the blade, and it can be done on both sides. So that when you end up having crossings, you can turn, Release, cut, um, and this is also very important because this is essentially how you invert your blade. This notion here, especially this, and on the other side as well, where you come in, cut, turn. So that's a drill you can do at home, just cutting side to side, and then doubling the cuts up, or violently changing from one guard to the other, one finesse to the other. And then what you start to get out of that is these actions where you come to the cross. Okay? And that's it. Thank you very much.